October and we really focus on breast cancer. And there are many themes, um, just to mention one of them is living beyond breast cancer. And it's a time that we all uh, come together, uh, connect communities uh, to spread um, the, the word about breast cancer and hopefully create awareness to many people. Um, any person with a breast, I think, um, should be aware of the normal health of your breast and keep checking it uh, all the time. Um, but having said that, one needs to know the risk. Um, having learned about the risk factors for breast cancer, so you, you really know your risk, for example, age as you grow older, above 35 years, if you have a positive family history of breast cancer, uh, it, 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 or if there is, um, maybe you've used oral contraceptives for a long time, uh, it is important that you now go for breast uh, cancer screening. And this includes even a mammogram, for example, self-breast examination and having a review by uh, a qualified medical personnel. So one is just um, the awareness, the health talks that are going to be given um, to know that mammogram saves lives and people should be, if it is recommended, one will need to go for it. Uh, we'll share about um, risk factors for breast cancer. We'll have survivor stories, those people who've gone through cancer, breast cancer treatment and have survived, and they'll be sharing their stories. We'll also be talking on how one can become an ambassador. Maybe you've been through this journey and you'll be an ambassador to spread out the word of hope. And beyond breast cancer, one is still a father if you are a man or you are a husband. If it's you are a woman, you're still a mother, you still, you know, an aunt. You are many things, you are an employee. So life has to go on. So we'll be talking about survivorship and also we'll be reaching out to our staff uh, at Kenyatta National Hospital to, to know about uh, the services we offer in the hospital and we'll all display from um, uh, surgery, we'll have oxygyne and we'll have oncology units and just really different departments in the hospital will be coming together uh, for this uh, noble cause. We know that um, cancer can affect anyone. And us as KNH uh, staff can also be hit by cancer. And we've seen in the past, many of our staff have cancer. And we are not just focusing on breast cancer, we'll also talk about other common cancers. And it is very sad when you are a, a, a healthcare professional and you still come with the late presentation of cancer. So we are focusing on what our staff should be looking out for and how they can go for early checkup, early and timely treatment, and just busting um, the myths around, around cancer. Come one, come all. It is very important that you come. Uh, this is a very important opportunity uh, for, for our staff to, to engage and ask questions, get health talks, and speak freely about what is uh, worrying them and get to know that uh, cancer can attack anyone and we are not spared. And being that we are working in a hospital, we have access that many people out there never have access. They worry about money to, to pay for screening tests, but here the hospital is saying, we are here for you. We'll do screening for you. And in case anyone is picked with cancer, we'll get a timely treatment and the chances of cure are very high. So it will be targeting both men and women uh, uh, staff members and um, in any case, even if it's breast cancer, 99% of them are reported in women, but we have a small percentage reported 1% in men. So the fact that we all have breasts, we are at risk of getting breast cancer. So we, we urge all members of staff to come for this day. If possible, we'll be um, at the helipad grounds and 
that will be happening on the 27th and 28th of this month so you are all welcome we our theme this year is just living beyond breast cancer and connecting communities so we want you to come and spread the word even in your community when you go out there you know that when they know you work in Kenyatta they automatically say you are a doctor so take this opportunity to learn about cancer and when you go back home to your church to your community spread the word around about awareness and as Kenyatta Hospital the management is ready to support you so that we can save more lives.